Hello to my Virgos and welcome guys, welcome, okay? I'm doing you guys reading for October 15th to the 31st. Um, I'm sorry for bringing you guys late readings, but I have a lot going on. So you guys forgive me, forgive me, forgive me. I come in peace. <laughs> okay, so without further ado, I know you guys been anticipating. So let me just go into your reading. Um, and I do have new cards, by the way. And I'm using those cards on you guys to I'm doing late readings for. So you see the good side that, you know, there's always a good side to the situation. Anyway, so this is for Virgos for October 15th to the 31st. You guys do have the Ace of Pentacles here. You guys do have your second card as the Devil. You guys do have um, Five of Pentacles. I already shuffled this card like a thousand times, trust me. You guys have the Wheel of Fortune. Um, so I already see some good stuff happening, but I also see some shaky things happening. Virgos, and you have the ship here. And my card of Under the Roses. That's what it's called, Under the Roses. Um, you have the snake. Whenever I see snake, I don't think some... Ah, ah. But you have the sun, though. You have the sun. Look how bright that sun looks. The sun comes and shine on everything that's dark. The letter. Then, on top of the card, you have the journal. So that tells me... And then underneath that, you have the star card. So that tells me... But then there's the mice. So that tells me that there's some type of news coming in for you guys. Um, when it comes to your love life, probably from your partner. Um, also, I do see that starting, what started off in this reading is you gaining money. You're going to be gaining money. Uh, maybe you and your partner met through work or you and your partner are business partners, um, but you're also lovers. So, or maybe your partner gives you money. Or you give your partner money. Maybe you give... And I feel like some of you are dealing with a Capricorn here. Um, or I feel like someone is addicted to drugs or alcohol. I feel like for some, you guys are dealing with a Capricorn that you give money to um, at this time. Or um, somebody's giving somebody money. I think it's the ver I think it's you guys giving this um Capricorn money. Um also I do see where some of you are lacking. Like you don't have enough money. I feel like some of you are or oh, this could be your partner not having money and that's causing some type of um shake up in your relationship i feel like someone is lacking and someone has and due to that it's causing some type of grief in your relationship if that makes sense um i also feel like there's some changes that's happening in this relationship during this time for some of you um Some of you are planning on taking a trip. Virgos, you guys are planning on taking a trip. Um, you're planning on traveling. Or for some of you, this could be separation from your partner at this time. Uh, um, for others of you, this could be a distant. Um, this could go a lot of ways. Or some of you might be receiving inheritance from your family. Um, or gaining money some way, foreign, from another country or so. Um, for others of you, this could just mean that there's distance between you and your partner. Or um, you guys will be traveling and planning some trips at this time. Also, the crazy thing is that underneath the uh, Ace of Pentacles was the ship. 
And the ship talks about separation, traveling, journeys, um, distance, transition, transportation, adventure, inheritance, prosperity, growth, and all that good stuff. Um, it could be either or, or of those things. It could be an inheritance. It could be uh, um, getting paid from afar. Um, it could be separation from you and your partner. It could be taking long trips with your partner. However, this message could convey to you, could come to you. Um, that's how you should receive it. Now, also, if you guys are dealing with this Capricorn person, I feel like this person is being sneaky or this person, you're going to feel betrayed by this person or you already feel betrayed by this person. For some of you, um, or you feel like, maybe you feel like your partner is not telling you the truth. Or you feel like your partner is manipulating the situation or, or um, is lying to you or tricking you to believe something that is not. Or there could be some type of betrayal. Don't, really, when I see the devil card, I think about some spying. I think about spying and someone going through someone's phone. Um, but there could be jealousy. There could be jealousy. Maybe you're jealous of your partner. Your partner is jealous of you. Or it could be a betrayer or they're lying to you. Some kind of trickery and sketchy things are going on here. Um, and underneath this is... Underneath the five of pentacles, which talks about loss of money. And it's crazy because the ship also talks about loss of money or gain of money. And also um, distance and stuff like the inheritance. Or move or exploration or traveling. Um, the five of cups. Okay, underneath the five of cups is the sun card and we know what the sun talks about the sun talks about happiness success maybe out of this situation we bring you guys victory and happiness and success um in this relationship um also for some of you you'll be receiving a letter a news um a message it could be a mail about a a job about a proposal um certification contract deals document um it could be a written message or documentation that you guys are going to be receiving from someone this this could be an earth sign person such as yourself um or fire sign person okay leo sagittarius Aries. i also see gemini um you guys also got the lover's card here you have the lover's card you have the empress such a beautiful card. You have the Page of Cups. Okay. Then you have Two of Wands. So this tells me that some of you uh, might be going, traveling to go see a Gemini. And I feel like for some of you, um, your partner is dealing with someone else. It could be a water sign person or a Leo person. I feel like your partner is dealing with someone else and this person could be pregnant or um, this person could be pregnant or there could be news coming in for sure about a pregnancy. Um, some might be flirting with you. I feel like a water sign person could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio person flirting with you whenever i see the empress and sometimes the snake could also mean someone else another woman so whenever i see the empress and the empress is right directly underneath the snake hold on let me show you guys better picture okay you see how the snake is by her neck ready to bite okay um, whenever I see the Empress, I think about the other woman, okay? Most of the time. Sometimes you're just talking about women that have kids. Or maybe some of you are dealing with a woman with kids that have a child or that's expected. Or maybe some of you got this woman pregnant. And that is the hidden truth. I feel like there's something hidden here that's not being said. 
um, or this could be the Capricorn you're dealing with that is pregnant or has a child for you. Um, but I feel like whoever you're dealing with has more than one person. For some of you, not all. If you're in a happy relationship, kudos to you. Um, this does not pertain to you. Um, if you're going through some things in your relationship, this is for you. Okay. Um, because the journal talks about secrets or known hidden mystery, intimacy, knowledge, um, memories. Um, it could be study projects, discoveries, um, reading secrets, hidden, or this means there's some type of secret that's hidden or revealed to you. Something's going to be revealed to you. Um, to your, you're going to find out something either from your partner, your partner going to find out something about you that you're doing that you're not supposed to be doing. And then the page of cups talks about somebody that's flirting with you or someone that's pregnant by you. Um, was bringing you news of love. Um, and the two of wands comes underneath the letter. So I feel like this could mean that some of you might be getting new contract deals. Or some of you might be... Uh, um, if you're dealing with a Capricorn person or fire sign person, wherever you... I feel like you're dealing with a fire sign person that you're probably going to be... Um, for some of you, I feel like this could be someone you're waiting for to get back to you. You're waiting for this person to arrive. Um, for others of you, this could be pertaining to a job and you're waiting for the person, um, maybe your interview to come through. Or maybe you're waiting for the result of your interview. Um, okay? I feel like there's somebody that you're, you're meeting at the end of the month. Okay, guys? Um, that's what I have for my... I also feel like there's a celebration that's going to be happening. Um, someone is going to celebration. I'm celebrating a wedding, uh, a, a birthday party, or someone might be getting married in this month of October. Maybe you know someone that's getting married that's having a wedding. Okay, that's what I have for my Virgos, for your love reading for October 15th to the 31st. Again, don't forget to push the button below to subscribe. Don't forget to like and share. Also, don't forget to comment below. I do read those comments. Um, don't forget to, if you would like a personal reading, you could contact me at Cindy, C-I-N-D-Y, gold, G-O-L-D, 28, at gmail.com, okay? Thank you guys so much for your support. I do appreciate you all. I love you guys. Thank you. Au revoir. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.